Hello guys, welcome back. As you can tell from the title of this video, I will be sharing with you guys what's new in my closet. Some of my favorite designers like Kate, Totem, Loewe, Idol, Saint Laurent, Hermes, and more. If you're interested, stick around. Okay, so let's get started right away. I just received my package from Idol yesterday. I absolutely, absolutely love Idol. They have the most beautiful jewelry. I'm currently wearing their Solo 3 and their diamond earrings. I kept it simple because I picked out a few pieces from them and I want to layer it. Idol is one of my favorite, favorite luxury brands. Uh, the ethos behind the brand is amazing. These are all lab-grown diamonds with 14 karat gold and they are kind, cruelty-free and I absolutely love the jewelry. They are so, so beautiful. I received them last year and I've been wearing them ever since and I've also started gifting pieces from them for friends and family and they absolutely love it too so thank you once again idol for sending me another beautiful goodie bag i feel so special <sighs> they're such a lovely lovely family and a brand to work with it's truly a blessing thank you so much idol and um let's get to the unboxing packaging that's an a plus from me i think packaging is so important because i feel like it just adds that special touch and on the inside it says something very special and i completely agree similar pouch to what i got last time they're really soft and roomy so it fits a lot of things inside Ooh, i'm excited um so these are some of the ways you can wear the pieces yeah certified and hand checked right what's inside here so the pieces i I received other pieces that I've selected so I am aware of what I'm getting oh what is this is this a travel jewelry pouch so I will be traveling for the month of February and this couldn't have come at a better time and this bit opens here too I think yep so thank you for that special touch and I love 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 the color I mean I love neutrals as you can tell let's get to the unboxing bit if you're familiar with Idol, all their jewelry comes in this beautiful kind of packaging which looks like a book and you open it up inside like this you tear up this bit oh my gosh I can't wait I have some yummy pieces in here wow oh my gosh it's so beautiful Seriously, I feel so special when I receive something stunning like this. Oh my gosh, it's, it's so beautiful. So this is was on my wish list for the longest time and it is the Joanne. This top piece that I've seen everyone wear this one, I absolutely love it, is the Lucia. I'm not sure how it's gonna look at me, but I really, really wanted this. And this special beauty, this diamond pendant, six diamond pendant is Lena. I absolutely love, love, love their 14 karat gold chain. I've been wearing them every day. I wear them in the shower. I swim with all the jewelry. There's no tarnishing, which is pretty amazing because sometimes uh, with certain brands like the chain and the jewelry loses their luster. I haven't had that incident with none of my idol pieces, which is saying a lot. And uh, you know, it, it's really nice and functional because these pieces come as modular pieces so you can wear them in different ways and but you can also add it with your existing jewelry which is amazing and i think the price is definitely approachable like you would be able to buy something from here and not break your bank and i'm rambling so let me try these on the lucia which is this one here so pretty so as you can tell it has like multiple slots that i can insert in and i mentioned this previously my earlobes are kind of weird so usually these kind of styles never fit me but what i love about idle modular pieces are they have multiple slots so you can actually adjust it so let me see if i can do this on camera let's see this Of course my ears are red because they're super sensitive. Oh my gosh. This is so pretty. I think I could even wear the cocoa piece that I got last time 
as a third additional piece here. If I added that piece on here, it would look like I have multiple piercings. So let's do this other beauty to try on. It's the drop piece and it's so special, this one. I think it's a gorgeous like an evening piece or daytime piece. This one here. Hold on, let's be still. This is literally the most beautiful dainty drop earrings. Okay, you know what, let me try this on. Hopefully I got it in the right slot. Let's see. Oh my gosh, I mean I put it a little snug but I still absolutely, I think I could go a little low if I wanted. I would definitely wear on special occasions, date night, dinner night. It's super elegant, classy, and like I mentioned previously, what I love about the idol jewelry is they're so beautiful, but it, it never looks like the jewelry is wearing you, you're wearing the piece. I mean, look at that, how pretty that is. This gets a lot of compliment too. This is the Solo 3, and I think they just came out with a new one. Uh, 0.50 carat. The other necklace. Should I layer it with what I'm wearing? I think I should do that. Because why not? Right? And this beauty here, the Lena. It has six diamond pieces on there. And the gold chain has three slots, so you can wear it in three different lengths. I'm wearing the choker length here. So I'm gonna go for a slightly longer length on this one just so that I can layer it. I'm sorry you guys, it's my princess. She's snoring in the background. All right, let's try this. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. That's what it looks like. It is absolutely gorgeous. I mean, you can wear it as is. I'm layering it with the Solo 3. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna be distracted for the rest of the video now. Cause I could just stare at these pieces. I think I could wear this slightly lower. Let me try it a little lower. Okay, so this is what it looks like. I feel like when I look at it online, I absolutely love them. It is even more gorgeous in person. And Valentine's Day is around the corner, so I would definitely spoil yourself with something beautiful from here. Check them out. You really can't go wrong with idle pieces. I've been gifting these pieces ever since I received them. And everyone I give these to, my loved ones, they absolutely love it. And obviously gift it to yourself too because why not? It's also a really nice pick-me-up for days when I feel like blah, I wanna wear some light pretty makeup and wear beautiful jewelry and that just makes me feel good and pretty. And at the end of the day, I feel like jewelry is something you can have with you forever and you can always hand them down, it's timeless, so check them out I will link them in the description box below everything that I'm wearing I will link it in the description box below if idol is having any sort of promotion I will be sure to link them in the description box below too and I would like to thank idol so much for sending me these beautiful pieces I really feel special thank you and I definitely feel beautiful in your pieces thank you once again to the idol family so let's move on to something practical I stopped by the Wolford a boutique on Madison Avenue and picked myself up these uh, these tights these are my favorite ones in the style the pure 10 tights just enough sheerness and uh, super comfy I got them in nude and black love them so I like these for looking for a nice tights and you wear a lot of skirts and dresses I would recommend them they have just enough sheerness that you can see it but still covers and I will try to see if I can find any celebrities wearing these tights. Um, I think I, Hailey Bieber was wearing this Met Gala. I, I will insert a photo of it right here. Let me show you another practical piece that I got from that photo. Hopefully it's in this box. I mean, look at the packaging. Gorgeous. I went with a size extra, extra small and an extra small. And the shade I got is Cray, which I'm hoping will flatter my skin tone, but I've seen really good reviews about 
uh, these Skims shapewear. They're priced quite well, I think. They're about $38, which I think is a good price point because generally shapewear tends to cost a lot. So I felt like for the price point, I was willing to try this and Netta Porter carries a full selection of this. Another piece from Kate. As you know on this channel, I am obsessed with the brand Kate. I literally love, love everything that they make. This top that I'm wearing is also from Kate. It's the Maddie top and I've worn it so many times. I receive a lot of compliments on this. This gorgeous bodysuit. I'm obviously gonna try these on for you because you can't really tell here what it looks like. It's a body, it has a button closure on the bottom, which is nice. Off shoulder, super cute and confusing at the moment. So I'll have to try this on for you. I think the size I got in this was a small. With Kate items, I'm either a small or an extra small. So with this, I decided to go with a small just cause I feel like I've gained weight recently and I don't feel very comfortable wearing super snug stuff and I know body is meant to be tight but I want to be able to breathe in it. So both the K-tops that I got, I got them in a size small. I believe the fabric on this is viscose blend. I got this because I wanted to get it ever since I saw it but since it was on sale I decided to pick it up. My rule of thumb for shopping for sale item is if I wouldn't buy it at full price, I usually don't buy it at sale. I just don't buy something on sale because on sale, I buy something on sale if it is something I wanted at full price so that way I end up not buying junk from sale that's how I shop sale items I feel like it's a good tip if you wouldn't buy it at full price don't buy it at sale so that way you don't just accumulate a bunch of junk in your closet I've done that when I was younger in the past it looks similar to what I'm wearing but this is the sleeveless I absolutely absolutely love this I wanted to add this because all my Kate Maddie top sweetheart neckline like these are all full sleeves so I wanted a sleeveless one and I know I'll be able to get a lot of wear out of these ones. I absolutely love 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 Kate and I have a dedicated I have a dedicated closet space for just my Kate items her pieces because they are phenomenal great quality and I don't know, I just love the fit of it. I love the brand. I love everything that they make. They're so beautiful and they make me feel pretty. They make me feel pretty and I love it. And I love how it works with pretty much anything. Like I could wear this with those baggy jeans. I can wear it with trousers. I'm sure you could wear it with leggings, but I really don't like the tight on tight look. It's another classic piece. I decided to get these because I felt like it was time for me to invest in something like this because I'm always buying these kind of tops on the high street. Oh, that's the receipt. Send that there. Classic white button up. I wanted a shirt that looked like my boyfriend's shirt, but if my boyfriend was just two sizes bigger than me. So it's relaxed fit, not, not oversized, not tight either because I wanted to wear something that I can throw on top of jeans, trousers, and also maybe layer it with a turtleneck. And also I feel like Saint Laurent pieces run small. Like I tried on a tweed jacket that I really, really liked. It was on sale and I tried up to a size 40, but it still didn't fit. And I have another Saint Laurent jacket that's on my wish list that I hope to have in the future is this guy right here. I will try it on for you guys. I got it in a size 38. It's a simple white classic shirt. You can't go wrong with it. I plan on styling it many ways and I hope to get a lot of wear out of that shirt. What else? Where did I put my Prada jacket? You know what? Let me do this. This piece I got, um, I think I got this at sometime in November end of November. It was the most difficult piece to find. It was sold out for the longest time and they had it in stock briefly and I purchased them. I almost wanted to buy two pairs but I was like let me try it on first before I commit to two pairs because I wanted to get two different colors. <sighs> Oops my battery is dying but let me quickly show you guys. It's the Hermes Chipri Chipri sandal. I don't know if I'm saying that right. I've already tried it on. I think I will show you my new sandals. These are the new Hermes uh, Chipri. I've already tried them on. Worn them around the house just to test it out. Got them in a size 36. Um, Glad slippers. So I got these to sort of 
fill in the slot for my Valentino and Givenchy meals. I've like worn them down. I've worn them for over a few years now. I still wear them but I wanted to add another pair that I could just throw on and it's not fussy. I think it's all sold out now. If they do come back in stock or in the store, I might pick up a another black pair what the hype these were a really difficult pair to find but i'm happy i have it and i know this is a summer sandal but i will be hopefully getting a lot of wear out of that one uh, another piece that i picked up from another one of my favorite brands is this totem jacket it is quite beautiful i have i think a pretty okay decent collection of outerwear in terms of like the floor length i wanted to get something that i could throw on that's not floor length but still chic and comes with the scarf i believe it's wool in the camel shade and i got it in a size 36 it's lightweight so i can probably wear this in the spring and fall i wanted actually a wool coat or cashmere wool coat that is not floor length because most of my max Mara clothes are i either calf length or floor length and i wanted something shorter it's soft i believe it's wool but it's like the most softer wool that's what i also love about max mara coats is the wool is quite soft and nice like if you look at this coat it has a very luxe kind of feeling the fabric feels incredibly soft three years i've started to filter out my closet i try to shop I try to shop less at fast fashion and try to buy more luxury pieces classic in my opinion some of the more classic pieces just because i want to have them in my closet for a longer time and i want to go for classic pieces because i don't want to get tired of them but you never know i might think it's a classic and fast forward to five years later i might get tired of them but then there's always a resale market for these luxury pieces so i could either hand them down or sell them at any one of those resale stores resale boutiques online and i would still not be wasting my money at least that's how i feel also picked up this from men's low a t-shirt anagram t-shirt i got it in a size small this time so it's slightly bigger than the one i got in gray last time with the red anagram i wore that t-shirt a lot the quality on these are insane anyways another piece that i recently picked up at prada i've been wearing this salmon piece so i've worn this piece a lot it's like a bomber style and also has that scrunching detail on the bottom it's like the olive green and i got a lot of wear out of this one because it was casual but still put together and i didn't have so much of this i don't have anything like this in my wardrobe and i only have like blazers or coats so the blazers are slightly more formal i think i mean i could make it quite casual but you know the blazers are semi-formal so i didn't have anything in between like i don't have a denim jacket this fit in that slot in my wardrobe these bomber style jackets and they're bombers but they're not like they're bomber style jackets they're casual but they're not overly like varsity college university kind of jackets either so i like that about this one which is why when i saw this at prada i really liked it i almost got it and i thought maybe i won't buy it but my mom picked it up for me which was so nice thank you mom for this i absolutely love it Prada triangle with the wool blend so it's just the nylon fabric here and the wool on the sleeves and the backing and it also has like this detail here that i can scrunch it up to make the jacket more cropped and i know that the prada nylon is really resilient and durable because i have that prada triangle bag and i've carried it ever since i got it so i started carrying it sometime in november and have been carrying it almost every day so that's like the last three or four months so and it looks brand new and i've carried it almost every day so i know that the nylon is really resilient and good I actually want to get a Prada tote too in the nylon fabric just because I want a non-fussy bag and I feel like these are non-fussy. I love the Prada triangle. I think this is the third piece. In ready to wear, I have like that denim shirt with the Prada triangle. Then I have the Prada triangle bag, the nylon bag, the re-edition, and then I have this jacket. These are everything it in terms of all the new pieces that I got. Um, I feel like all of these pieces are going to be practical and i am going to be able to get the cost per wear so those are some of the items that i bought in the past couple of months so i'd say the past three months and uh 
I will link everything in the description box below. I'd like to thank Idol again for sending me this gorgeous jewelry. Thank you so much. This is my first video of the new year. I've been quite busy with the move with my sister's baby and uh, my mom being here. So hopefully I will get back into the cycle of uploading videos again. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in my next one. Thank you so much for watching.